join us today as we uh, work on this evergreen maple uh, root over rock uh, as one of the updates that I totally forgot to do a couple years ago. So let's do that right now. So yeah, this is that uh, evergreen maple got the name of it if you guys know the name of it put in that comment um, root of a rock uh, I sliced the top off and I totally forgot about it so um, it, it's yearly uh, go back and whack the heck out of it season you know it's I wouldn't select this maple for bonsai work um, it doesn't lend itself to do a couple things uh, one it is evergreen um, so if you're having um, like bad water um, this is a tree for you because um, the leaves they don't burn surprisingly not um, it's actually pretty resilient um, let me get on top really quick this thing is pretty resilient um, to leaf burn. So you're having leaf burn, you can't change your water quality, um, or you have shade. This tree is for you. Um, so this is this, took a while for it to leaf out. Um, it was looking pretty rough a couple weeks ago. starting to heal over the top here. So I'm gonna let this keep growing for a while until it kind of heals over. I might whack these back again. That one's kind of ugly. Get a clipper. Strong branch here. Take that out. Strong branch there. Let me take that out. Yeah, that's it. Let it grow. That's a lie. I might eventually cut it back this node to let it take off. It doesn't like healing over. See, it's in some big heels. Roots look really nice. Uh, I think that's it for today. I'm going to let it grow out, fertilize it again, and then uh, let it be. Um, it's probably one of those um, never show trees, um, just experimental. It's probably one of those trees. If you uh, made it so far, I'd like to continue seeing this guy updated. Uh, leave a comment below, and then uh, I'll see you guys later. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.